Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am back with one of my favorite videos to film and that is my monthly favorites video. So I'm gonna be sharing all the items that I have been just loving throughout the month of January. So it's gonna include a lot of lifestyle this time around, including some food favorites, some organizational finds, like some really good like kitchen tools. And then I also have some like clothing and beauty favorites as well that are so good that I can't wait to share with you guys. I don't know about you guys, but felt like January was such a long month. I don't know what it was, but it was felt so long. Maybe because I don't like love like the winter weather as much. So I feel like that's not as motivating for me. So definitely let me know how the month was for you. Did it go by really fast or was it like super slow? Um, because for me, yeah, like I said, it was so slow. But now at least we're getting closer and closer to spring, which I am so excited about. So lots of girly and pink finds to share with you guys. And speaking of girly and pink finds, if you have not already, definitely check out my newsletter subscription list below. You can sign up for my newsletter because I send out girly and pink finds every single Friday. It's my girly pink Friday day where I share like all super cute things, just like random things I'm loving. And it's all exclusive content. I don't share anywhere else, but my newsletter. Plus I send out a few more emails every single week on some other content and to get notified for my YouTube videos right away because sometimes YouTube doesn't always send out notifications so if you want to be on the list I'll leave a link below to sign up. All right so we are going to get started. I have a bunch to share with you guys and I'll have it all linked below in case you want to check any of it out in that description box. So if you're on a mobile phone you just tap the title of the video and it will expand for all the links to everything and let's just get started. All right, so we're gonna get started with a really fun girly find. It's an Amazon find too, and it's this super adorable phone stand that I really love. I bought this maybe a couple months ago, and I really love how it looks on my desk. I think it's so pretty, but it's also very functional. Or it's nice to have like on your vanity or in your bathroom, like on your counter, like if you're getting ready or something, curling your hair. Sometimes that could be very just like, you know, boring to do because you're just like, you know, curling your hair and not really have much other things to do. So you could watch a YouTube video or watch Instagram stories or just like have your phone propped up with like music playing, something like that. And I love propping my phone up on here and I love that it's adjustable too. So you could adjust it to the um, level that you want it and it has like kind of like a rose gold base and it's just so pretty. I think this was under $10, if not around $10. It was really inexpensive and it was super easy um, to assemble. Um, and I just love it so much. So I definitely want to include this. And then another pink find actually, um, this actually does come in a couple other colors though, but this mini waffle maker, I actually, I have two of these. I actually hauled one in my, what I got for Christmas video. These are pretty inexpensive. These like mini waffle makers. And you guys, this one is heart shaped. So I've been really enjoying making my gluten-free um, pancake waffle mix because you could either make it into pancakes or waffles. And then I've been putting it in this heart-shaped waffle maker, which I think is, it makes it taste better. <laughs> That's for sure. I don't know what it is, but it's just so cute. And I love the heart shape. I think it's so festive. They make these for like a lot of different seasons too. I wanna say for like Easter, they do like a little egg shape or something like that. And then for like Christmas, I think there's like a snowflake print one and all that stuff. And then they have even just like the original one that doesn't have anything on it. But the heart one, I think is just super cute. And I'm like, why not? So I love that it's pink. So I will try to find it. These are very, very popular. And it's so easy to clean too. Like it's held up really nicely. So definitely love it. It's called Dash, something like that. But it's, it heats up super quick. It's so handy. And like I said, I've been really enjoying like a gluten-free mix. But of course you could use any pancake mix or whatever you wish um, to put in here. I actually have seen even some TikTok videos of people trying other foods in here. So I don't know. So I just like it though for waffles and it's so delicious. So definitely love this, so it's very, very handy. Let's go over to a beauty favorite for the month. I have used this lipstick nine times out of 10. I'm wearing this lipstick this month because it is so amazing. So it's from It Cosmetics. I shared this in my last video that I did as like a beauty video. And I have to say it is such an incredible lipstick. So what this is, it is by It Cosmetics. As I said, it's called Pillow Lips Solid Serum. So you guys know I love my Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lipstick. It is still an absolute favorite of mine, but sometimes I like to switch things up. And also for the winter time, I do like sometimes a glossier lipstick because it's way more hydrating. 
So this is extremely hydrating, but very pigmented, which I feel like is a hard combination to find. You click this at the bottom to get more product out. It's in like a lipstick form, but it's a glossy finish to it. I have it on today. The shade is more of a toned down version of Pillow Talk. It's in the shade Humble. The price point's really nice too. And I feel like this is super, super quick and easy to apply. Like you can't really mess it up. And if you do go over your lip line or something, you could just smudge it and it comes right off. Like it's easy. So I feel like this is a really, really nice. This is like um, top rated too. So definitely check it out, you guys. I am obsessed with this. And it just feels literally like a pillow on your lips. Like it's so smooth and it's amazing. I don't know even know what's in the formula that makes it that amazing, but it's so good. Um, and it's like super, super hydrating, especially for these really chilly months. This is incredible and a definite must have if you're looking for like a good lipstick, try this one out in the shade Humble. I feel like you guys are like really, really gonna love it. Let's actually move on to what I'm wearing today. This sweater has been a absolute favorite of mine. I actually wore it on repeat quite a bit because it is seriously so soft and fluffy. And I love the shade of pink. I think this comes in a couple other color options, but you guys, I am loving this sweater so much. It's just such a good basic. The silhouette is just a, a good like staple like silhouette of a sweater and I love the v-neck so I could do like my necklace stack like with the heart necklace I have on. I've just been loving wearing it so much. It's just so cozy. It's not itchy scratchy. It literally is so soft. I wish you guys could feel it right now. So I really love it. It's just so easy. You know in the chillier months you just throw this on with like some jeans something like that and cute flats and you have a really cute outfit and it's super cozy. All right, up next is an organizational find. I'm really excited about this. I wanna say I shared this in a holiday gift guide. I could be wrong though. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> I can't remember exactly, but I love this tech organizer case. So I think they probably originally designed it to take if you're traveling, but of course I'm not traveling right now, but it will be great for future travel. But what I've been loving it for, it's kind of keeping everything in the same section for like my chargers, my cores, different things like that, because it could be very easy to lose things, like even AirPods, store them in here when you're not using them. I feel like this is a nice like little organizer. It's clear, it has two little zippered sections. I had like my camera charger, I actually had the other one. I was just using it to charge this camera um, battery I'm using right now. But I have my iPad charger in here. You could include just like so many different things that you need, if you could do like SD cards even in here, just to kind of keep all your electronic items and chargers and whatnot all in one space and that way they're not all over the place and then you're like trying to find it and then you know then you have to repurchase something like that this will keep everything all in one section super organized and i just love the pink velvet or like this rosy color has a little handle you could zip it up i mean it's just so easy it has like a little wi-fi symbol on the outside but i really love this and it wasn't too i don't think it was that much um, if I remember correctly. So I'll link it below for you guys. I think it's free shipping because I found it on Nordstrom and I think it's just so darling, like a darling tech case. So definitely love it. I think this would be super useful, which is why I wanted to share it. While we're on the topic of tech items, I feel like I might as well just share this with you guys too. I've shared this a long time ago on my channel, but I recently just bought another one because it just recently, this one just shorted out after many uses or years of use. Um, I just had to replace it. So this is held up so well, but it's the 10 foot iPhone charger or phone charger. Oh my goodness, like seriously, if you don't have one of these, definitely check it out. Especially if like your charger or your like outlet is like far away from like your bed or whatnot. I like to be able to, or even if I'm like working, you know, at my desk and I need to charge my phone, sometimes the outlet is far away. So it's nice that you can still use your phone but charge it at the same time. So this is literally <laughs> such a long cord. It's like I said, it comes in 10 foot, which I have, but I use an Amazon find, um, but it does come in even a couple shorter um, lengths, but I just recommend the 10 foot because you never know how far, even if you're in the future for travel at a hotel room, something like that, and the outlet is really far away, this is just really handy. And this has lasted me years and years. Um, so I only had to replace it, I think like once and it comes in a couple other colors. I think this is like the gold because they didn't have the pink in stock at the time when I bought it, but I will check it out for you guys and I'll link it below because this is so, so good and very useful as well. I wanna talk about a Walmart find that I really loved throughout the month. 
and you guys may have seen these joggers in my Walmart try and haul recently. These are velour joggers, which I spoke about in my video that I'm really excited. They're bringing back velour like joggers and track suits because I used to wear them all the time in high school, I think it was back then. That's like the last time I think I, ha I bought velour a velour suit, like track suit. And I just think they're so comfy, but so glam and cute. So I had to pick these up from Walmart and I believe they have a matching sweatshirt, but I they didn't have my size at the time when I was ordering. So I just opted for the joggers, which actually still looks cute with like a, like a Henley or something like that. I'll link the Henley I also got from Walmart that matches. This was like the top clicked item. You guys were obsessed with these just as much as I was. So I'm very excited about them. They feel so soft and plush, like really nice quality. So they do run true to size. I got an extra small, I'd say very true to size. And I will link them for you guys because they're so good. And hopefully these are still in stock for you guys. But if not, just keep checking back because these are really nice. Let's just do a food find. I am really obsessed lately with dried mango. I shared about this on my stories. It is like one of my favorite snacks. Uh, there is something about the... This is, I ordered these from Thrive. I've gotten other dried mango from like Wegmans, which I actually found it was like a lot drier and not as like fresh. So the ones I get from Thrive are super, super fresh. I talk about Thrive all the time. I was never sponsored by them or anything. So this is not sponsored. Although that would be really nice because I love Thrive so much, but it is so worth the membership. You have to pay like $5 a month for membership, but you save sometimes on average over $30 every order. So it more than pays for itself because compared to grocery store prices, I've actually looked at the prices compared to what I purchased at the grocery store and it's significant savings. So um, I definitely recommend it. So I'll leave a link below. I think there's a link I could share with you guys because um, anyone could have like a referral link for friends and whatnot. So I'll share you. So I'll share with you guys mine and then you could also share your link with your friends. Uh, but it's 25% off your first order, which is even more savings. And even Thrive will give um, you credits back if you don't even save as much as the $5 that you pay every month. So it's just all around really great. And now I was on a tangent about Thrive, but I want to talk about the mango. This is by the brand. I'm just going to have a, I can't, I'm not going to try to pronounce this first word here. Mavuno Harvest. So check these out. They're delicious and very addicting. <laughs> I bought many bags of these and they're organic, non-GMO, everything like that, all the good things. It's just literally the ingredient, the only ingredient is organic dried mango. So love these so much, such a random find, but I know you guys have been asking for me to share some like healthier snack options. And I have really been loving these so much. They're delicious. Actually, while we're on the topic of food, I might as well share with you guys my favorite teas, two different teas that I've been loving lately. I've recently switched from coffee to tea in the morning and I've really been enjoying. They're both by the brand Tazo. I'm actually looking into some other tea brands. So let me know if you have like a favorite brand that you like to purchase that makes good teas. Um, Cause I have definitely now been really into lots of different tea, you know, flavors. So I get the Awake English Breakfast, which is just like your basic kind of black tea. But I also have been loving making chai lattes, like iced ones. And this is the tea that I'll get when I want to make a chai. And it is by Tazo again, it's organic chai. That's basically all it is. And it's very good. But like I said, let me know if you have any other favorite brands that make really good teas because I'd be very interested to try. So these are like my two favorites and I think you could just get these at like Target or like any grocery store really. So I'll link them though because I purchased these I think at Target or Walmart, something like that. So really, really good. And again, I love hearing other people's favorite food finds. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. Okay, next find is a beauty find again and it is actually skincare. So I found recently this three piece that I share this over on stories, but I thought I'd share it here in case you don't watch my Instagram stories. Or if you're not like on Instagram, which by the way, if you're not already checking out my Instagram, definitely um, check it out because I'll have a link below in case you guys want to see like more behind the scenes. And I post a lot more like sale alerts and just some extra content there. But I recently, as I said, shared this Tula set that I found. It's even better than any like blogger discount that I found. So I will link to it below because it's not from the Tula website. It is a three piece set and it comes with the cleanser, which I use every single night. I came and telling you how many bottles of this cleanser I've used. 
seriously so good. It doesn't strip your skin of its natural oils and whatnot. It's just, it doesn't dry you out. It's so good. And it melts off all your makeup. So I use that in my double cleanse every morning. Now this moisturizer is in my rotation. I do use the um, Beauty Bio moisturizer right now for winter because my skin is just like extra dry. So I just wouldn't recommend this if you have like super dry skin during winter. But if you have like normal to, you know, slightly dry skin or combination oily, something like that, this is so good. This 24 seven moisturizer from Tula. And then this glow and get it in the rose glow. You guys, I'm obsessed with this. My mom is obsessed with this. We both love it so much. So what this is great for, now I don't have a mirror. Actually over here, I'm gonna look. Um, you can apply this right on top of your makeup and it just refreshes you like instantly and adds like a really nice brightening glow under your eyes. It's not like sparkly or anything like that, but it adds such a nice amount of hydration we have been loving this. Like my mom and I love applying it during the winter, just like during the super cold months, especially just to refresh and like hydrate and with the cold wind and whatnot, this is just really nice. And you could also, sorry, I'm like looking in my mirror, trying to see where I'm applying this. Um, you really can't mess it up. And you could apply it on top of your cheeks uh, as a highlight. And it just adds that really healthy glow. And I love the rose glow one the most, but I've tried the other ones too. They're all great. But what I want to share though is all three of these pieces, which are all favorites. You guys know how I feel about gift sets. Sometimes they could be not that great of a value, but this is an insane deal. So I just wanted to pass this along to you guys because it is so good. And every single product is just amazing. And I use it almost every single product on the daily, besides obviously the moisturizer, I'll probably be putting that back into my rotation, you know, once the weather warms up a little bit more, but it's, I love it so much. I've gone through each product so many times. The Rose Glow and Get It though lasts a really long time, so you won't be like rotating this as much through new ones, but definitely such a good one. So I will link it all below for you guys. This is such an amazing deal. It's even better than my Tula discount that I usually give to you guys. Okay, I have another beauty favorite. I also shared this in my best of beauty for 2020 and it is the Tangle Teaser. So I have this compact version and I have the brush with the handle, which I use the one with the handle like all the time, but I got this um, compact one for my purse, which I thought would be really, really nice and handy to have. So I love the Tangle Teaser because it's not even like your regular bristles. They're kind of like a plastic, but they don't like snag your hair. And I have hair extensions, so I really have to be careful with what kind of brushes I use in my hair because you don't want to damage your hair and like rip your extensions out, which it would not be good at all. So uh, this is one of the few brushes because usually you have to use the ones that like come with your extensions from the company. So I really used to use the wet brush just like from here down, but this is the first brush like actually use in my roots and like not have it snag on my extensions and it's so gentle, but yet it's so effective and gets like all the knots out of your hair because my hair could tangle pretty easily because it is longer. Um, but this is such a good hairbrush and it is pretty inexpensive and I just love it. I also love that if you want to like wash the hairbrush at all, um, it won't like none of the water will absorb and get like moldy inside and whatnot. Like it has like a plastic base so it won't absorb any water, which is also really good. And I like the compact for your purse because it just comes with this cover. So, you know, if it's rolling around your bag, it's covered and um, protected. So I really, really love it. And this pink is so cute. So I definitely had to share it, but I'll also link the one with the handle that I use all the time just at home, but I'll link this purse option as well. I wanna share with you guys another fashion favorite. I wore this in my, may have actually also been in my 2020 favorites video. This is the top I wore, and I know some of you guys said you loved it, so I wanted to share this one, which has been a favorite of mine. I think it is such a pretty blouse. This is such a good wardrobe basic because Floral is not going out of style. It is definitely just such a classic print. So this floral print is so beautiful. And the silhouette is so nice and classic as well. Again, wear it with your necklace sacks or just simple. You can wear it to work with dress pants or you could just wear it casual and with jeans. And I think it is so pretty. It has a lot of like smocked detailing at the bottom of the sleeve and here at the top a little bit. And I believe this is on sale right now as of when I'm filming this. So I will try to find it on sale for you guys. It is such a good one. And I got the size, my regular size in this, I think it's true to size. And the back also, if you could see, 
goes a little bit longer so it covers you in the back which is also really really nice i think this is so pretty and so darling okay up next is a beauty favorite this is a newer favorite of mine i actually just started using this more towards like the earlier part of january and then i was using it every single time i did my makeup and it is from charlotte tilbury you guys, this is the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. You know I'm obsessed with the Airbrush Flawless line. I have the foundation from Charlotte Tilbury from that line, and I have the setting powder and a lot of other products. Now this one, I don't know why it took me so long to try this, but I just have to say this is a game changer for setting your makeup. It kind of just like blends everything together a little bit better and it locks it in and stays so long all day long and I feel like it just kind of controls like any shininess in my t-zone anything like that I just really really love this and the packaging of course I mean it is beautiful I mean it is the you know beautiful Charlotte Tilbury packaging that they're so well known for and I just love it so much though I mean obviously pretty packaging is nice but the product has to be good and this product is amazing so I definitely wanted to share if you're looking for a good setting spray I feel like that's also a step I tend to sometimes forget about, but I have throughout January used this and it's been really a game changer for making my makeup last so much longer. Okay, I have like an organization favorite and I got this maybe a month or two ago. It is this notebook from Target and I have to say, Sometimes I'll buy some like planner accessories or different notebook, but sometimes like it's the one I least expect to use the most. I, this was one of my most used notebooks out of like all my stationery. I love a good stationery moment, but I'm just gonna show you guys a blank page because I've been like writing all my to-do lists in here. Every, I'll like basically start the day with a new fresh page and write the day of the week and then make my own little check boxes and make my to-do list for the week. And I just love this notebook so much. The cover is pink, but I also love like the gold binding, which is so beautiful and it was really inexpensive. And it, you could even, it says like the date up here on the top right corner and it's lined. So you could make a lot of notes. So every single day I'll just like do, like I'll write out today's to-do list. So at the top, I'll make a section for like my lace and lash and then another section for Karen Rose my online clothing store and then I'll do like a section of like personal things that I need to also get done that aren't like business related and it's kept me so organized to have it all in on one paper I do have a lot of like electronic organization as well I have like a, like a google calendar and stuff like that but I just find for just day-to-day -day little to-dos this is really handy and like I said it's so accessible it's available at Target so it's by the sugar paper brand i think and it's so pretty it's like pink striped on the outside it is so adorable okay up next is another random favorite but i thought it was so pretty this is my new ipad cover that i got um when i ordered my ipad i got this from amazon and i have to say i really like it i think it's so beautiful i mean i obviously bought it because it was blush pink but it's such a pretty ipad cover and i really like the quality of it i didn't even change my ipad background uh, but i have also like these little covers like for cameras like on like for my laptop and this ipad i, put, I don't put it on my phone but it's a really cute like you could slide it over if you want to use the camera and then slide it off if you don't want to use the camera and it just keeps it covered and i just think they're really handy so you could just stick these on that's an amazon find too so i'll link that as well for you guys but i just love this like little ipad cover i thought it was so handy and sometimes they feel like they're hard to find that are like reasonably priced but nice quality and the perfect color this one is great it also doesn't cover the camera or anything so i'll link a below for you guys i think this comes in other versions for other ipad versions so but yeah i really love this so much it's so pretty and I think we're down to the last favorite. And then I'm also just going to share um, why I took off a week during January on my YouTube channel. But um, I also want to share this favorite with you guys. I love this. And this is also just giving me all the like cozy winter but yet Valentine's vibes. Actually, the heart though really you could use any time of year. I don't feel like it's just for like, you know, Valentine's themed things. I think this little pouch from Stony Clover is just the cutest thing ever. I think they still have some in stock. This was like super popular. Like the initial launch, I think, of this sold out super fast. But I think they restocked it again. I can't remember where I saw it, but I think I saw one where 
Um, you, they have like a pre-made one that says love on it and it's on sale. So I'll try to see if I can refine that again. Um, but this is so beautiful. It's in the pink cozy material. And then I also customized it. You could do any color patch you want, but I did the pearl patches uh, for Karen Rose and I just absolutely love it so much. And the back I just did plain. You could do even probably front and back and customize it. I recommend having them sew it on and doing the customized sewn patches and paying for that extra like 10 or $15 for them to do that because you with the cozy fabric, you want it to stick. But I have seen like on Sony Clover, they also, if you want like the Sony Clover look, but maybe a, not spend as much. Um, they also have clear pouches, I'll have a picture of it and you could put like a little heart patch on it and you could just stick that on yourself because that's what I've done in the past and they stick really well. So I think that's around like $30 or something like that for that one. So if this is a little bit out of your price range, I will also link that one below too because that one is so cute. And you guys, anything Stony Clover, I'm obsessed with. So I also think they also came out with a Valentine's heart pouch too. So I'll see if I can find that one for you guys as well. But yeah, this one's so cute. I love the pearl letter details too. So you could even do the pearl letters on another item if you didn't love the pink cozy and you just wanted something more basic. You could also do like pearl letters. I mean, you could totally mix and match everything from their website. All right, so that is it for my favorites. I wanted to say just thank you for all the love and support you guys have shown me. As you guys may or may not have noticed, I took off a week on YouTube, although I was doing a lot of work behind the scenes, but um, for a couple different reasons. The first one was actually, I was just getting prepped for the Karen Rose spring launch, which I'm so excited about. There's a lot of behind the scenes work that goes into it. So I just took the week just to do a lot of behind the scenes for that. And I am also moving. I am gonna be moving into my new home. So if you guys wanna see like some home content, like decor and just like organization, pantry organization, refrigerator organization, just things like that, let me know if you wanna see that. I really miss filming videos and like chatting with you guys. So I was like, you know, dying to get back to filming and back into that routine as well. But it was definitely worth it because I can't wait to share with you guys. But anyways, I am going to end today's video here before it gets too long. Let me know if you have any favorites that you discovered throughout the month of January. Let me know how your month is. Say hello in the comment section. I love chatting with you guys. So I'll look forward to that down below and give this video a like if you enjoyed the favorites. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Karen. I make fashion, beauty, and lifestyle videos here on my channel. Lots of girly and pink finds. So if you love that as well, I'd love to have you join in and hit subscribe below. And as I said, I'll link below like my newsletter subscription if you wanna sign up for that, as well as like a, on the Like to Know It app, I'll link my Like to Know It um, handle in case you wanna check me out there too because I share a lot of like um, sale alerts and restock alerts there, lots of like good finds there. So lots more in the description box below along with everything that I mentioned and I love you guys so much and I will see you all in my next video very soon. Bye.